Okay, so hi guys, this is Miss Lollipop and welcome back to another episode of the Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. So, today we are back and can we just appreciate this face that Kelsey is making? I mean, like, what? What is going on in this house today? Um... Right, so, she has just woken up, the children are off to school, in the last episode I left it off and then I've done a little bit off camera by improving some skills, um, and basically just getting everyone's needs up because everyone was in such a bad place, um, so now everybody is feeling, you know, fairly good, obviously everybody needs to be taken care of, however, today is um, a focus on Zoe, because Zoe actually ages up today. So we need to make sure that her potty skill is up to level 3 and she should be getting her thinking skill up to level 3 um, in just a second because she's actually working on that herself as well. So we should be all good there. Um, now in the last um, videos or the last few, few videos, you guys have been freaking out about how disgusting the house is. And trust me, I get it. It's just taking care of all these children and trying to get their needs up, especially since we were sort of in a rush with um, Hayley in the last episode to try and get her skills up before she aged up. Um... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, my throat is like really bad today. Um, so yeah, we're basically trying to focus on that. So in this episode, I swear to you, I will tidy up the house. We will make sure that we get everything tidied so that when we at least um, start the episode off, everything will be clean and tidy. So Kelsey's had a full night's rest, thank God, because she hasn't had one of those in, for, uh, in so long. So she is now ready. Um, I want to go have her have a shower. And then potty train Zoe at least until she's up to level 2. And then Zoe can start teaching herself or actually going to the potty herself from then on. And then she can get her skill up so that we can age her up in just a little while. Um, the garden needs a little bit of help. We've got our bonsai shrub. We've got uh, birds of paradise that are out. And these are all in season. So we should be getting some things back from those um, fairly soon. From the looks of it, we haven't got too many harvestables. We've got a few over here so they can be sold. And we also want to make sure that we sell some of her baked goods in this episode. We also have a little bit of money. Um, I'm trying to decide on what I'd like to upgrade with that money. Now, I could obviously do a bit of a renovation. Um, obviously not with a thousand simoleons. There's, there's no renovation that's going to cover that sort of cost. So I was thinking maybe we'd just upgrade the fridge or the cooker because both of those um, will help her increase the quality of her food. Now, obviously, the more money she sells her food for, the more money we will get, if that makes sense. So... Anyways, turn the cheat around. A teacher caught Dallas looking at another st student's test during class and sent him to the office. Um, let's go ahead and give him responsibility because that's the easiest one to develop anyways. So she's going to have a shower and then we're going to go potty train Zoe and then we can start tidying the house and getting everyone ready. The kids are going to be home from school. I did have them work hard in school today. Um, I don't know if any of them are going to be getting a... Um, uh, promotion and it looks like um Haley's going to be increasing to a C uh, to a B grade student if he's lucky um Dallas will be a B grade student as well um who are you you're Jackson you're already a B grade but we need to get one of his skills to level four and also make sure that he does his um his school project and oh my god somebody destroyed their school project oh no oh they're gonna be so upset <laughs> so those are something that we do need to uh, do in this episode as well. So let's go ahead and make sure this little girly whirly um, gets herself on that potty so that we can start concentrating on tidying the house up a little bit and concentrate on Kelsey because we never get to do that anymore. So there we go. She's going to sit on the side of the bed and wait for her to do her ablutions. And um, we also have 24 hours to pay our bills, which we need to do. Um, so instead of actually upgrading that fridge, it's probably not going to happen because we need that money to pay our bills. How much do we owe? 620 simoleons. Okay, I can handle that. You know, that's that's not even too bad. But we have actually got the air conditioning on at the moment. We have got the air conditioning on at the moment because it is actually a heat wave. So um, we need to keep that on. And unfortunately, the bill is going to be a little bit more money, which is fine. We can handle that. So, what is going on down here? So, you're you're currently going to the toilet. That's fine. You are going in your nappy and you're really tired, but you're playing your game. So, that's fine. Dallas is a B-grade student. Haley is a B-grade student. And, obviously, Jackson is just doing his own thing. So, that's all good. 
You need a little bit of fun, little sir. So how about you go and play on that space monster thing over here? Um, is everybody's fun quite low? Yeah, it actually is. I tell you what, I'm going to go have them all go play over here. Because that is just a really easy way for their, um, their fun to go up. So they're all going to head off over there. And um, did I actually give you a makeover? Did I put you in that outfit? I mean, maybe I did. I don't even know. Um, yeah, I did give her a, a, a makeover. So you guys said that her hair wasn't supposed to be blonde and they changed to blonde when she ages up to a child. And I didn't realise, so I've actually changed it back to brown. So that is all good and covered. So you guys shouldn't um, scream at me for that one. We should be good. And um, that's good. She's just been potty trained. Let's go ahead and try potty training her again. Sit her on there so that she gets to level two so we can go and chill out and do our own thing. She's then hungry. Um, you, my lady, need some attention. You need your nappy changed. Um, so everyone is just, everybody is just in a, in a state. Um, so we need to make sure that she gets her skill up. There we go. Okay, so we can stop potty training her now. Um, now, Kelsey's hungry, so I'm going to go have her sort herself out first by grabbing some leftovers. She'll probably grab a bagel or something. Oh, I didn't mean to pause that. Right, okay, so you, my lady, are going to sleep. Probably not the best idea. Probably better to grab some food first. So let me grab the food. I'm going to drag it upstairs for them to eat. You can grab a serving of the food, um, and then she can go to sleep afterwards. There we go. Okay, and then this food can then come downstairs just here okay now little girls who needs food oh none of you do um i tell you what you're all really tired actually so how about we we stop doing that and we send them on up to bed their attention is really low though so um it might be better if kelsey puts them to bed so you need your nappy changed anyway so come over here and change her nappy and then um put her to sleep so that hopefully her uh, affection will increase there we go go ahead and get her sorted out Haley is burning to death oh my god oh yes because I changed her into her outfit I'm so sorry hold on let me get her changed into her hot weather well so that she doesn't um freak out and burn to death on me there we go she's all good now right go ahead and play some more because you guys are doing great that's fine you're probably gonna need to come back and go sleep in a little while so I'll sort that out afterwards looks like she's sorting out the baby just here or the baby's just ignoring her and going to bed <laughs> basically um zoe didn't eat, do what i said and eat the food so if you could actually listen to me thanks that would be great grab the food yep i know she's very hungry but i gave her food and she won't eat it so <clears throat> right okay so when's she giving birth she should be giving birth um maybe in this episode or the next one so that should be great she has just gone to sleep um could you please get up because i really need to sort you out like please up Please, I'm sorry. There we go. Okay, why are you why are you sleeping like that? Like you might as well just actually just go a normal sleep because there's no point in napping. What's going on with you? Uh no, Mortimer Goth, we're not interested. Thank you. Celebrate Zoe's birthday. Uh no, we don't throw birthday parties in this household. You get a cake and that's as far as we go. So There we go. Change her nappy. No, 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 change. Oh my god. Okay, fine. Go to the toilet and then change her nappy. Go, go away. Go away. Just listen to what I said and then change. Why would you walk all the way downstairs? And oh, I actually hate The Sims sometimes. Like, why would you do that? It just has, it has no logic. I don't understand. Right. Okay. The kids can come back now. They're actually so tired. So if we could come and grab some leftovers and head on off to sleep. That would be great. Um, actually, just head for a nap. A nap should be enough to get your, um, to get your, um, your energy up. Um, you're already fine. For some reason, your energy is as high as it goes. So that's all good. You can start working on other stuff. So you need get to get one level, um, one skill to level four. So how about we improve? this skill that she gains here so we'll just have her keep playing on this and she should be enjoying herself you're doing your thing okay right now we can concentrate on kelsey so she's out here researching the plants and um, cool how about instead of doing that we go ahead and evolve that needs to be evolved okay let's go ahead and sell all because we don't need any of this stuff at the moment um i think we've got everything in her inventory, she's got enough carrots and she's got enough sage, so we're fine with that. We also got a picture of, oh, sorry, an autograph of um, 
of Thorn Bailey, which is worth 50 simoleons. Um, which, to be honest, we could probably just sell because we don't even, you know, need that. So that's fine. We've also got our picture with him. We need a picture with the other baby daddies. Um, so he needs to move down. There's there's some other baby daddies in between there that I need to get off camera. That I keep forgetting about it, so I need to make sure I do that. We have some money, which is amazing. Um, do these need to be watered? Uh, this plant does not need water. Okay, awesome. So all of these plants are great. So let's have her come inside and start working on some food. So um, if we bake, we want to bake some carrot cake again because her carrot cake is amazing. I tell you what, I'm going to go ahead. Let's see. Um, is it better to upgrade the stove? Food quality three. Food quality two. Well, okay, I don't know if it's the stove or the, the other bits that are going to be the best idea to upgrade. But if we go ahead and pick... Uh, maybe like that one because that one's like the cheapest that has the highest amount of food quality um, and I'll just put that in like white uh, or is there an ugly cream that will match the rest of the ugly ugly house um, is there that color I don't even think it comes in that horrible color I could put it in like in wood in wood texture <laughs> um, right I kind of want to change everything in here but I can't really afford it um, I mean, that would be okay. There we go. Um, well, it's got like little lines on it. So I don't really like that. I don't really like that. Um, was that the same one? No, that was a different one. Okay, what about the quality of this one? Okay, maybe we should buy that one. Because I know it's more expensive, but it makes more sense in the grand scheme of things. So, we'll go ahead and upgrade that. So, look at that little kitchen. I mean, it's looking great. We're doing amazingly. Hopefully, she will like working on that. And I can finally get a better sink that it maybe doesn't break as much. So, let's get that little sink just there. I am loving it. Right, perfect. So, now we should be able to bake some more food. So, carrot cake for me on the new upgraded kitchen that i just bought you so you better be you better be happy about that and it's actually looking pretty good i mean i know it doesn't match the walls or anything but i mean it's not about matching for the moment so but there's a little child sleeping on the floor down here i'm gonna send her on up to bed up here and zoe is doing well she just keeps going to the toilet over and over and over and over and over so she has currently improved her mental skill good job my lady so you now need to use the toilet and have a shower. So I'll send her up here. We need to tidy this um, house up. I will make sure to do that in a little while. Right, so use the toilet, have a shower, come down here and grab some food, get some leftovers and put yourself to bed for me. Right, so you guys are awake because of the monster. Um, so how about you just go and nap over here? What do you need to do? You need to do your homework, actually. Um, so go and get that started for me. There we go. We're working on that baking. She also needs to use the toilet again. I'm pretty sure it's because she has a bladder infection because she held her wee-wee for too long, which is very unfortunate, but fine. Um, so let's make sure that everyone is good and living their lives as we want them to. You're already controlled. You are just peeing over and over. As soon as she hits level um, three, we're going to go bake a cake and ate her up so i think she just left that food wait where is the food oh the carrot cake's here oh look at it poor quality that should not have been poor quality though uh just use the toilet please because um that's something that you need to do just go ahead and do it right perfect so come down here and bake some more foods carrot bread i don't understand why it's poor quality though like unless she's using poor quality foods to make it um, I literally have no idea why that is the case. Go downstairs and make the carrot bread, okay? Listen to me. <laughs> so, wh what type of food have we got? These are all normal quality and nice quality. Uh, yeah, see, I don't know why that's the case. Um, let me just drag those foods in now. There we go, stay out of her inventory. The baby's talking, or the little girl's talking to her. Um, why are you still downstairs? Did I not just tell you to wake up and go to sleep upstairs? Like, I'm pretty sure that's what I told you to do. Go upstairs and go to sleep. What do you mean she can't get upstairs? Is her movement skill not high enough? No, her movement skill is definitely high enough. Co okay, go here then. 
What's wrong with the other? What's wrong with that bed? I don't understand. Use this bed then. Go in. Why? Go here. What's in the way? Are these are these puddles in the way? Why? Why though? Why can't they get in the room? I'm so confused. I literally have no idea why that is the case. And why do these keep being poor quality? What's going on? Why is nothing working? Right, come over here and start mopping this because I have a feeling that these puddles are like messing everything up. I don't, I don't even know why. What do you need to do? You want to leave a note for someone? No, that's not happening. Right, go and mop these up. What? Did, what? No. Did you even mop that? Like, no, no. Mop these puddles. These ones. Please, come over here. Come and mop. Right, good. Okay, hopefully the kids can get to their bed now. And, oh my god, she's in such a bad way. Right, okay. So, you. You're freaking out. Please, just put yourself to bed. Yeah, it was the puddles. Apparently, there were so many puddles that they just couldn't get to their bed. Okay, fine, whatever. I don't even care. No, okay, you're done. That's fine. Use the toilet. She's hungry. Come down here. Grab some leftovers. That's fine. And then she needs to go to sleep again. Oh, my God. I need to buy her, like, the best bed possible if I can afford it. Um, because her sleep is still so, it's so, so difficult to get up. What have we got in terms of her satisfaction points? I really want that money tree so we don't have to worry about money anymore. Uh, but that's not the case. We're, we're pretty far off. Right, so there's actually the lottery. So play the lottery, purchase a lottery ticket via the computer or phone. So I'm going to go ahead and actually have her play the lottery. Um, how do I, how do I actually do that though? uh purchase lottery ticket because i'm really hoping that she might actually um be able to win i mean that would be crazy amazing if we actually won the lottery like i would be ecstatic i mean honestly this girl she deserves it i wouldn't even care but you know it would be amazing for her to do that so before she goes to bed i'm just gonna go have her repair loads of different stuff um, and then what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to skip um, for a little while until Kelsey's been to sleep and she's fully rested so we can continue on with our day and obviously get the bake sale started. Um, and then I'll go ahead and pick up once we're all finished doing that. So I think Zoe's going to be ready to age up in just a second. So we should probably um, get that over and done with first of all so we haven't got to worry about having a baby in the house. Um, honestly, the worst things are when the babies need a bath and also um, when they're hungry. Like, they're the two worst things to deal with for me, at least. So, uh. there we go. No, no, please, you need to just finish. You can't, you can't leave that in there. Come on, come over here. Just finish making it. Come on, come on, come on. Finish, finish, finish. Oh, my God. No, 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 I don't need this. I don't have the money to afford this. Stop. Go and extinguish it. No, no, extinguish it. Extinguish. Please. Please extinguish it. We don't need this. Please. Oh, I don't care. Do you think I care? I've got other things on my mind. Oh, and all the babies are awake. They're all coming downstairs. What are you doing? What's going on now? Oh my god. How do I even reach that? Extinguish that. Oh my god. And now she's passed out. This is the worst episode. She's passed out in a puddle of her own piss. Whilst the, ba the bin is on fire. The babies are crying. This is a mess. Oh my god. Please, Kelsey, wake up. Please. Oh my god. She's gonna like, she's gonna die. Hello? Come on. Oh, something else just set on fire now. What else set on fire? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Extinguish it. Extinguish it. I know you're tired. Come on. Please. Oh my god. No, the baby's fine. She's been standing there the whole entire time. Come on. It's just gonna keep spreading. Just put it out. Is it out? Oh, I hope it just puts itself out, please. Oh, and she passed out again. In a, oh, well, at least she's not actually in the puddle. She was literally licking her own pee earlier. Oh my god. How much money did they give us? 300 simoleons. Oh my god. That's fine. That covers enough. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. I'm... I, I, I can't. I just can't. Um... Just go to sleep for me, just because you just keep passing out. There's actually no point in you being here. Just go to sleep. The children, 
they are something else altogether. Everyone is disgusting. This is horrid. I actually hate this challenge. I officially yes, hate right. this challenge. Right, age her up. I, it's not even going to be a big deal. It's not even going to be a big deal anymore. I don't even care. Just stick her on the floor. Get her to age up. There she goes. whoop de doo Amazing. Great. Thank you. Right, grab some food. Grab some food. Take a slice of the... Why are you going back upstairs? Get, get the hell downstairs. Go downstairs. Grab some food. Good. Okay. Right, once you've grabbed your food, you can then use the toilet, have a shower, and go to sleep. Why are we sitting in here with the kids? Okay, you know what? Whatever. I don't even care. I don't even care. Right, we need another bed. So... We can't even afford another bed in here, nor can we afford to buy another bed. So you're gonna just gonna have to share three beds for the moment. So you can go to sleep because all the other children are fine for the moment. You're all good. No, stop asking to come over. Right, okay. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. You remember I said, you know, like we're gonna we're gonna be fine. We're just gonna have, you know, Kelsey um, you know, go to bed, you know, get some sleep and then Everyone can, you know, we can continue with the bake sale. Well, d look, that didn't happen because we didn't have enough time to have a bake sale because we were too busy sitting there for half an hour with a fire in our house. Okay, so I'm sorry that this is a mess because this challenge, honestly, is a mess. It's an absolute mess. And now she's asleep again. Please, someone help me. I need help. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> oh, please, 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 please. Well, on the bright side, at least Zoe looks pretty cute. I mean, let's let's have a look. She looks pretty cute, doesn't she? See? Look, there we go. We've got one cute baby. There we go. Well, all the other babies are pretty cute anyway, so. Oh, my God. Okay. Right, it's going to be fine. I'm going to basically cut most of this episode out, probably, because um, everything's gone crazy. Everything is has gone absolutely crazy in this episode. I don't even know what I'm doing. She's up. She's having a shower. And the shower is the slowest thing ever. Oh my god. I really want to just be able to have them all, like, you know, do their own thing. I want to be able to have Kelsey just sell some baked goods. We haven't sold baked goods in so long. So I'm going to continue this episode until she wakes up. I don't care what I have to do. But we are going to continue it. And she's passed out again. We're going to continue this episode. Um, and then I am going to... Uh, make sure that she gets up and we are gonna sell something. I don't care what I what I have to go to to be able to sell things But we are gonna do it. Okay Right, okay, so we are back and Kelsey is now in an amazing mood So we can continue on with the episode the children are gonna be fine for the moment They're just you know getting themselves ready Um, everyone is actually okay even though their moods all look terrible all down here It's basically just because their fun is kind of low so they need um, some attention But that's fine because we can concentrate on Kelsey now, which is what I wanted. So I want to have her go out here and make sure that all the plants are watered. We also need to make sure that we sell some stuff because we are out of money. Um, and we don't have any we don't have any lights. We don't have any electricity in the house. So we need to make sure that we pay all of that. Unfortunately, that fire kind of screwed us over because Kelsey kept walking away from the um, cake. And um, we should find out if she won the lottery. Honestly, I would be so thankful if she won the lottery. I have never had a sim win the lottery before. Um, I don't think I'd ever be so thankful to win the lottery, but I'd I'd love it. I'd honestly love it so much. So, um, Kelsey has to actually clean all this stuff up. But by the end of this episode, we will have a clean house. I promise you that. I don't care what I have to do, but we will we will have a clean house. So, she's now up. She's tired and she's hungry. So I'm gonna come down here and get her some food out. Oh, not that food. Get her this food out here. Come and take a piece of the cake. Uh, responsibility. Yeah, we'll do that one. Okay, come down here and grab some cake. There you go, and you won't be hungry anymore. See? All good. See, that's all you need to do. Just sort yourself out. Not too hard. Not too difficult. Right, did I ask you to start hugging your child? Like, that's not part of what I said for you to do. Okay, then we need to start making some baked goods. So how about we clean out the spoiled food in there? Because that's... Okay. Just get in my way, kid. That's fine. Come and clean out the spoiled food. So there's no dirty food in there. And then we can start baking some more goods. So let's try baking another carrot cake because she already has carrots in her inventory to use that. She's just cleaning up. What a good mum. There we go. She's doing great now, okay? It's all doing fine. So you need to go to sleep, actually. We're going to give um, Zoe a makeover in this episode coming because um, I'm not feeling her look right now, but that's fine. The kids have got school in a second, so we should 
be rid of them soon. All the kids are grabbing some food. Right, has everyone done their homework? If not, do your extra credit work. Do your homework. You have already done the extra credit work and you need to do your homework as well. Actually, you're going to go to sleep. You don't even need to do your homework. That's fine. Right, so we are going to bake. Um, bake another... Okay, carrot bread. That's fine. So, we have a carrot cake. What does that carrot cake look like? It doesn't look dirty. Oh. Excellent carrot cake. Oh my god, my girl. I am so proud of you. So, so proud. We also need to make a grand breakfast. Um, choose the cheapest one. Because um, we need to make a grand breakfast because they last the longest for her food. Zoe, you are just skipping school, my lovely. So, if you could head off to school... That would be amazing, thank you. And then she can start eating this grand breakfast. I want to make her have a few more baked goods because she actually just reached level 6 of the baking skill. So we have a few more things that we can bake. Um, we have fudge bars, which we can make. We need other things to make the other things though. So like shepherd's pie, we need potatoes for. We need exotic fruits for these ones. We need spinach and onion for these ones. There's loads of different things that we actually need food for. Um... So hopefully there's going to be some sort of way, some sort of festival where they're selling a loads of loads of you know goods where we can start getting our garden expanded for different types of foods. Um, she has now finished, so she can come downstairs. And um, actually, we're going to be finished with this grand breakfast in just a second, so she can have some of that. Um, I actually don't even care what I select for these ones because the kids aren't really my problem at the moment. So go ahead and grab a serving. Kelsey can grab a serving herself as well. There we go. And then I can put that back in the fridge. Who's calling us like crazily? Oh, God. All the time. Just whatever. I don't even care, honestly. There we go. She's eating her food. And, oh, we didn't even win it. Do you know who won it? Brittany Cho, who is a celebrity already. I swear to God, it's punked. She paid to win the lottery. She didn't even need more money. Like, look at me. I'm living in the dreads of humanity. My child is just sitting here in her own pee. Dirty. And there it goes again. What's going on? Oh, my God. Honestly, can we can we have some money? Like, I am I feel like I need this more. Um, She actually needs a bath. So we should probably just go and give her a bath to get it over and done with so we can start making some more baked goods and sell ev selling everything. We also have some fish that the kids collected as well to do. Right, okay, so we have some fudge bars. What quality are they? Normal quality. Okay, that's all good. We can handle that. Is there more bills in? Please, I don't need any more bills. Please don't do this to me. Right, view the inventory and then I also want to open them. Okay, I'm going to have to drag them out. So I'm actually just going to drag... No, not the grand breakfast. I actually need that. The fish can come out. The carrot bread. Um, the, the cakes. And the fudge bars can come out. The kids, um, I can't actually access their inventory, so that's fine. We can handle this. So go out here and stock that table for me. She actually just needs to use the toilet as well. So have her come back in and quickly use the toilet after she puts the food out. And then we're going to tend that table and start the yard set. Come on, buy something. What about this guy? Oh, Johnny Zest. He's, he's pretty cute, actually. Give him a friendly introduction and then give him a sales pitch. He might be next baby daddy. Maybe. He's looking pretty cute, actually. Yeah, next baby daddy, I'd say. Hmm, okay, that's cool. Give him a sales pitch. Hopefully he buy something. This guy here, Bert Baker. Oh, yes, he bought something. Oh, my babe. Johnny Zest, my babe. There, go and give him a sales pitch. Come on. If we, somebody buys this excellent quality carrot bread, that would be amazing. Come on. We've got some more things. Oh, the, uh, the yard sale ended. Okay, start another one. So hopefully people will come and buy this poor quality food that we're selling. Uh, quickly go use the toilet and then come back out. Just stay by the table, okay? Please, stay by the table. And apparently the house is dirty. Actually, we need to tidy the house, don't we, before this episode ends. I did promise that I would do that, so I'll make sure to do that. There we go. He doesn't fancy anything from our, from our food. What about this lady here? Hey, cheerful introduction. Hey, come over here. Girl Scout, do you fancy some food? Oh my god, she's going to labour. Oh, she's in labour. Okay. Right, um, let's head off. We need to go and have a baby at the hospital. We're going to actually send her alone because I don't really see the point in following her. So we'll just have her pop on off to the hospital and come back with her baby. So we need to send the children to daycare. There we go. Okay, so let's 
work on the children while she's having that baby for the moment. You, my darling, can just go to sleep upstairs in your mum's room. Good. Okay. Good, good, good job, children. So what do we got? We got a boy or a girl? Boy or a girl? What do you think? Boy or girl? Boy or girl? Boy or girl? And oh my god, it's another girl! <gasps> Perfect. Okay. Right. Let me double check for name suggestions that you guys have left. Let me go. Double check those comments. Right. Okay. So one of you guys commented, of course, since Kelsey is having a baby with a celebrity, the baby's name has to be very, very fancy. And of course... That was suggested by Rockstar2068. So they've suggested Anastasia, which I kind of really like for um for like a celebrity baby's name. So I'm gonna name her Anastasia. Oh, let me make sure I'm spelling it right. There we go. Anastasia. Right, perfect. And then the last name should be Bailey, right? Thorn Bailey. That is his name, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Th right. Anastasia Bailey. There we go. Oh my God. Wait, how? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. How am I? How do I? What? How am I having another baby? There's not even enough room to fit another baby. I, I have no idea what's going on. Okay. Um. Right. Next baby's name. <laughs> I'm going to choose from Rockstar's comment as well. Um. I'm going to call him... I kind of like Harrison, actually. Harrison's good. And that's Harrison Bailey as well. Bailey. Okay. No more children, please. Oh, my God. I don't... I actually don't even know how she has twins. Like, how does... How? How, though? I was supposed to only have one baby. That's what I was prepared for. How? Where, where are they? Where are my children? Oh, my God. I can't handle this. <laughs> no. Oh my god, I need more cribs. Oh god. Okay. I tell you what, I'm gonna sort that out in the next episode. I'm gonna sort their cribs out in the next episode. For the moment, I wanna just have... Oh wait, everything's clean. How though? How is everything clean? I tell you what, these guys that came in while we were doing our bake sale actually came in and cleaned everything up. What stars? What absolute stars? What, right, other than cleaning this stuff up over here... There isn't really anything else to do. They've all cleaned up for us. Oh, amazing. Amazing. You know what? You can come in more often, guys. You can come in more often, please. Come and take the food out my fridge as long as you tidy up. Right, this needs to be cleaned as well. So as long as we clean everything up and then I'm going to send Kelsey to sleep. Um, Anastasia is very hungry and Harrison is very hungry. So they actually need to be fed, but they're asleep for the moment. So that's, that's fine. We can handle them in just a second. And, oh my god, I can't even believe we managed to have two children. I don't even know how that works. Honestly, don't even know. I was expecting one child. I didn't even think we could have more than one child. I must have a mod in that currently makes them have more than one. But, you know what? I'll take it because the more babies, the better. So... She is off to sleep and I'm going to go ahead and end this episode off here. So as always, if you guys enjoyed, remember to leave a like on the video. And if you've got any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Can we just appreciate this baby just over here? Like, <laughs> I stink. <laughs> I stink. <laughs> oh my God. This is terrible. Um, Right. Yeah. So if you enjoyed the episode, if you've got any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Um, If you are new, it'd be awesome if you could subscribe because obviously it helps the family grow. And that's everything from me. So as always, I love you all and I'll speak to you in the next episode. Bye guys.